All 11 safely installed. And racing for the Denny Cordell Laverack and Lanwade Stud Philly Stakes over a mile and a furlong. Starry Heavens is the first to show with being ridden up on the inside Time to Boogie. American Sonia is also prominent with Flame of Air right up there too and Pink Carnation, another one that's keen to go forward. Empress of Beauty is just going to take a slot in behind them because there's plenty of early pace on the inside Time to Boogie. Right up there too, American Sonia. Starry Heavens is also with the leaders but Pink Carnation now has come through with the lead and goes on a length. So... Finally, one has got the measure of the front end, and it's Pink Carnation who leads by a couple towards the inside, Time to Boogie, Starry Heavens, and just behind them is Flame of Era. Kirkira is towards the inside of American Sonia, then a break of two or three back to Empress of Beauty, who's in front of Village Voice, and they're being chased just in behind by Lady Lynette. Towards the back is Jupe alongside Maxis. So they continue down along the side of the track. And it's Pink Carnation and Danny Tudhope who lead from Starry Heavens and Colin Keane who sits second. Just outside, or inside this one rather, is Time to Boogie and Gavin Ryan. And they're being chased by Flame of Era, Kirkir and American Sonia, Empress of Beauty just behind. Village Voice further back in the field with Lady Lynette and Maxis towards the back with Jupe. As they continue on the bend now making their way on towards the three pole. And out front it's Pink Carnation being chased in second by Starry Heavens. Just in behind them now is American Sonia with towards the outside Flame of Era. And they're being chased by Kirkira who's now asked for effort. Same can be said from time to be boogie. Empress of Beauty beginning to try and close and then Max is trying to do the same but wide and B Village Voice is now looking for a bit of ground and switches inside for more. Pink Carnation still leads from a chase to Long American Sonia trying to pick up from the back. Max is on the outside of Empress of Beauty who's staying on strongly and now Max is just beginning to try and challenge American Sonia as Pink Carnation drops back. It's Max and American Sonia. Village Voice trying to stay on worker here and Empress of Beauty and Max begins to go clear of American Sonia in the closing stages. It's the stable companions, Maxis under Mikey Shee. He's been pushed clear to take the Denny Cordell Laverack and Landway Stud Philly Stakes. It is Maxis who wins, American Sonia second, Village Voice is third, Kirkira is four, and they're in front of Lady Lynette, Empress of Beauty, Zhu Pink Carnation, Starry Heavens, then Time to Boogie, and Flame of Era. Yeah, she's a cracking Philly, Kevin. I won a maiden on her to start the year in Gorn, and um, to be honest, I was a bit unlucky on her, the last, well, not unlucky, but we went slow the last day in the Curra. And I still thought she ran well. It was only beaten five lengths or so. And I just knew if we went good and hard, and we did, a bit of ease in the ground. Uh, I was able to take my time. Got a lovely clear run at them at the straight. And I quickened up really nicely. She's won very snugly, in fairness. She's beaten a strong field, to be fair. Obviously, she's to, she had to improve on official ratings with some of them. Rated 97, including with her stable companion, she had to improve on. But she had a kind of profile she could do. It was only her third, fourth run. Exactly. Look, she won her maiden, she went to Nace, and... Couldn't happen that bit quick for her. Um, and in the current last day, like I said, we went slow, didn't suit. Um, but it's no surprise to me that she's won the way she has today. And as you said, they went a blistering gallop in the front end, didn't they? Yeah, we went good and hard, and, and I was delighted because she can be a little bit keen in the races. And um, I was able to take my time, get her to relax, and sneak into the race whenever I wanted. And uh, no, she's, she's won snugly. Good stuff. She could build on that. Yeah, absolutely. And. Um, Bit of ease in the ground coming to the end of the year, she really enjoyed it. So hopefully onwards and upwards again. Good stuff. I know you said the, the ground there's an ease now. What kind of ways are is it in a bit dead? Yeah, look, it's soft ground, no worse. Um but it's 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 okay. Good stuff. Well done. Thank you. Hello Mike. Watch live racing now on racingtv.com. <laughs>